Hi, I'm Jamie from ESL Teacher 365. In this Canva tutorial for teachers, I'll show you how easy it is to create coloring pages with Canva for online or in-person teaching. Let's get started. To start your coloring page, click on Create a Design and choose what size you'd like to use. You can also create a custom size if you prefer. I'm going to use the presentation size for my coloring page. Go over to Elements and type in what topic you want. You'll see Photos, Graphics, Videos. You want to click on Graphics. And you'll notice that everything is in color, so you can come up to here and select White. Now you'll have more images in black and white, which are perfect for a coloring page. Just click and drag to bring it over, and you'll notice that some of these say Pro, and then some say Free, and that's because I'm using Canva Pro. To get access to all the amazing features of Canva Pro for free for 30 days, you can use my link in the description box down below. Click the corner and drag to resize your clip art, place it wherever you would like, and add in some more elements. I'm going to show you how I can make this chicken appear behind the fence. Just right click and do send backwards. Now say you have something like this horse, but you want them to face the other direction then you can just go up to the top and click flip. And in this case, it will be flip horizontal. And then we'll do that same trick, right click and send backwards. And now our horse is behind the fence. I'm just resizing a little bit and adding a sheep and a llama. Now to add text, just click on text. You can add a heading and then type in whatever you'd like, but I'm going to use this font so that the kids can color it in. And I'm going to type out the farm. I'll highlight that and then come up here and change it to black. Reposition the font wherever you would like it to be by just clicking and dragging. Okay, I'm gonna reposition this so I have a bit more space around the edges. If you want to do a spot the difference activity, you can duplicate this page and then change up the second page. So for example, you can flip the direction of the chicken I'll change that sheet for something else and then right click, I can copy control V and now I have two llamas. This is a fun activity that you can do with your coloring pages. If you come up here, you can change the name and this will be the name of the file and then download. I'm going to choose PDF standard, select which pages you would like to download and then download. Now there are some coloring page templates as well. So type in coloring pages in the search bar and you'll see that you have a lot of different options. This is a great starting place. Obviously you might not want to use these exact templates, but I'm going to show you how I can change it up. So I've chosen this unicorn one and I'm just going to delete some of this information on here to make it more of a coloring page. Type in unicorns and I want to make this a bit bigger and I want to make this font one where the kids can color it in. I'm gonna change the font, make it a bit bigger still, come to effects and then you have this nice option and now they can color in the font. You can select the clip art and change the transparency and if you want to add another activity, you can add a page here and then these are just some templates. So I pull over a rainbow poem. Again, everything on this is clickable, so you can change the colors, the font, the images, just like I showed you before. You can see how easy it is to make these activities really, really quickly in Canva. Just add whatever name you'd like to save it, what you'd like to save it as, and download. Here's a sneak peek of how I use these in my one-time out school classes. So just click on your class and edit and scroll down to the four enrolled learners area and you'll see that there's a message and then you can upload a PDF. So just add the file and here I let families know that there's a coloring page for before or after class. I hope you enjoyed today's Canva tutorial for teachers on how to make coloring pages with Canva and a little sneak peek of how I use them on OutSchool. If you'd like to learn how to make a children's book on Canva or a worksheet on Canva, then you can watch these videos next. Happy teaching and creating on Canva.